Hello everybody, welcome to, uh, we'll call this vlog number two, number two, and, and that is how I'm going to run this series. So I'm going to vlog about what I've done. So the idea is to vlog about the progress on this bike. So, hmm, since the first video, I've given her a little wash over. I've used some degreaser and I've tried to put some of these panels back together and the reason I did that is I thought I I kind of had an idea of maybe registering it or you know once it's running registering it as a complete bike and then do the cafe racer a bit afterwards but at this point that seems unlikely um, these panels I don't know what the go is but they don't really fit very well I have a feeling that this one is the one that's supposed to be on here but this one's really really crappy I don't know who did the paint job on that but that's I don't know so yeah anyway so um, I have no intention of doing it like this at all there yeah the panels don't fit um, kind of it's not too bad on this side but yeah it's just I don't think it's gonna work giving it a bit of a degrease um, I can see a few things a bit more clearly in terms of the engine uh, it does not appear to be leaking as is from the top end but there's definitely a leak over here just over here I can see it up around that that side glass here, there's some oil in there, and that is not a good sign for this engine. But it seems to be like kind of a slide that side, the side glass is pushed out a little bit. So I'm gonna have to have a bit of a look at that. But yeah, in terms of the top end, all up here, all through the cylinders, no problem. So, yeah, but you can see, yeah, definitely. Bit of leakage there so yeah so you know not a lot of progress but it's been sort of a good little process to clean her up a little and see the panels on like see kind of where it used to be but uh yeah my son alex and i we had a good bit of fun um putting it together and you know it didn't really matter if it didn't go on properly but yeah just kind of got to know the bike a little bit better now, um, I've been having a bit of a look at one part in particular on the net, and that is the frame that runs right up underneath this panel here. So a lot of bikes, are, a lot of the cafe racer style GPX 250s have that, that one sewn off somewhere and got that flat seat. Whereas I think I'm going to keep it as a solid, as, as, the, as the frame was, um, keep like maintaining the integrity of the frame and uh, not hack into it. I'm looking at the seat styling, how that, how, how the back end of the seat's gonna work, and that tank's gotta go, it's full of rust. <laughs> um, once I sort of had a bit of a clean, if you have a look, like, yeah, that's been, it's been hollowed out, it was definitely, <laughs> yep, nothing in there, and then, whoop, and then in here. Yeah, that's been broken off and inside I think they've done some sort of a treatment, but There's a bit of rust in there, so I don't think I'm gonna use a tank. Might be alright just to get the bike running, but then Definitely gonna swap out that tank So here you go It's been great to get to know the bike a little bit more and uh, have a bit of a play around and Now I think the next phase so Vlog number two will be about ripping all this apart again, and I think I'm gonna get the bike inside and start pulling off that um, off the carby and uh, just give it a good clean out and move on from there. All right, that's it for the update. See you next one.